Hey everybody, Dustin Wheeler here. Uh, got some announcements to make. Uh, got some new people that I'm going to be working with this year. Uh, as you can see, I've got on my Waterland Fishing shirt. Uh, still going to be working with the old eye rod. Um, this year, I have actually signed up. I'm going to be working with Bill Lewis. Um, you know, a lot of people have said you know why lipless baits why 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 just rattle traps and it's like you realize they make a lot more than just rattle traps like we've got some baits here that you may not realize they made like the scope stick and the square bills the uh mr6s mr12s awesome baits awesome baits been using them for a little while just got a fresh order in uh, we'll also be working with Yamamoto Baits. Uh, my order has not came in from them yet. It got delayed. Uh, FedEx and all their wisdom shipped from Texas to Memphis to here. Yeah, makes sense. I'm in Oklahoma. So, but, uh, you know, working with Waterland, Bill Lewis, and Yamamoto... So that's kind of the main new ones. Um, you know, I've been using Yolo Techs forever. You know, you can see here, got one on the big boat. You know, I showed you in the last video the Yolo Tech that I have for the kayak, which don't have the light on it, but uh, I mean, ain't that a good looking kayak? Good old Hobie, Pro Angler 14. But the one thing that is also new, I'm teamed up with PowerPole for this year. Um, running the PowerPole Micro on the Hobie. Got the Blade Series on the big boat. Um, the big thing though, a lot of people probably wouldn't expect, a few of you already know, but the big thing is this, is going to be my main tournament rig for this year. I'll leave here in a couple weeks for Alabama for Gunnersville, fishing the Bassmaster Kayak Series. I'm planning on fishing four of those events. Um, Gunnersville, Possum Kingdom, uh, Upper Mississippi, and the Susquehanna River. I think those would be a lot of fun, be good events to play around with. Uh, see what all uh, we can do in them. I'm also going to be fishing the OKA Oklahoma Kayak Anglers this year. I'm going to try to fish all of their events as well. We'll see how my legs hold up because I'll be running the Hobie without a motor. You know, I'm glad that uh, uh, OKA finally did allow motors for this year for the guys that want to run them. But I'm going to use it as a reason to get exercise. But, you know. That, that's the big thing though. I, I'm gonna be doing most of my tournament angling out of the kayak this year. I'm a plastic boat pirate for sure this year. And you know, I'll definitely fish a few events out of the big boat. I mean, I've been playing around with it. We got uh, the big low range graphs up front now, with active target forward-facing sonar rules no matter what anybody says it's fun I like it it's aggravating but uh, yeah I think too with doing the kayak thing going to Gunnersville here in a couple weeks I am going to do a giveaway um, I'll make another post about it but what I'm thinking is closest person to what my total is over two days at Gunnersville I will send them a bait whatever bait it was that i caught most of my fish on if somebody gets exactly to the quarter inch what i caught for those two days i will send them an eye rod of the series that i caught those fish on so i think that'll be cool i'll make another post about it because you know everyone will forget between now and then i think that'll be fun get some uh Get some traction to the page, hopefully. Anyway, 
I, uh, if anybody has any questions, feel free to message me. I'm always here, and uh, we'll see you out on the road.